for instance, for instance, Ryan Wild about the uh, field goal block. He said you you hadn't in practice whatever jumped over like that before. What's, what are you supposed to do on that play, and what did you decide to do? Uh, that play was a middle block, so basically I'm supposed to jump up and try to block the kick from behind the line. Uh, what I decided to do was I, I noticed that the center had the cage and I went to the sideline asking the coach about if they would jump over the center. I, I noticed he had the cage and then they said I'll be able to do it, so that's what I'm trying to do. Is it the same thing, jump over him and don't touch him? Yeah. Is that what? Is that Coach Mason or Coach Jennick? Uh, I was talking to my linebacker, Coach Coach Mark. He said jump over him, but you're not able to touch him. Have you ever done that in your life before? No, I have not. <laughs> <laughs> were, you, were you surprised that you cleared him and it was as easy as it looked, I guess? Uh, not really. I, I feel like I timed it right, so I wasn't really surprised. You guys had a lot of success against this offense, but what do you think was the key to, to playing so well, especially against the run? Um, I feel like the, the key was us playing together and just, you know, not, you know, not giving up and continuing the fight. But um, on the other hand, we also had too many mistakes, and that's why I feel like we didn't, you know, leak too much and let, let them get, you know, a few extra yards that they shouldn't have gotten. Zach, did Auburn offer you, or did, did it? Un- um, they offered me yeah. it did. In the in the past, would you ever have made? It seems like you're kind of blossoming as a leader and that type of guy. In the past, would you have ever taken it on yourself to go tell the coach, "I want to hurdle this long mm-hmm. snapper here"? Um, I don't think I was ever in a, a position like that, exactly like that in the past. I, I would say, like back when I high, played high school ball, I, I was in a lot of positions like that where I was able to go to the coach and tell him, you know, no, tell him I'm noticing something. I kind of go through this through that. But you feel like you're doing more of that now this yeah. season, especially. Yeah. Where does that come from? Does that come from just playing well, or how does where does that confidence come from? Um, I, I would say it's a number of things. Number, you know, having you know faith in the defense and you know, the other players around me. You know, trusting trusting in me, you know my uh, my abilities. You know, having experience, you know, experience, and um, you know, noticing like tendencies from the offense. How much did you guys have to adjust when the second quarterback came in the second half in terms of what you guys were doing? Uh, there, was, there wasn't a, a big adjustment. It was just uh, more of an alert for uh, more of a, more passing, more, you know, he's more of a guy that, that's quick to run run uh, the ball after his first look. So, I mean, it wasn't a big adjustment, just the coach just learning as that he was in. Thanks, Zach. Thanks, Zach. Good job.